Have you ever had to do something really hard? My name is Michelle Anthin, and I'm the author of this book, Hazina. In Canada and the USA, it's known as Crossing the Farrakh River. Hazina is about a girl who has to do something really hard. She has to save her little brother and her cousin from enemy soldiers. Late one night, soldiers come to Hazina's street. Her aunt wakes her from a deep sleep and rushes her through the house. Her father says, Hazina, you must take your little brother Araf and your cousin Gadia and you must hide. I will come and find you. Hazina does exactly that. She sneaks her brother and her cousin past a detail of soldiers. Together, they cross a deep and rushing river and then they hide in the forest. They're there for days. When they come out, everything has changed. Their community is wrecked, their house in ruins, and worst of all, their parents are nowhere to be found. Hazina is based on true stories from the Rohingya people of Rakhine State in Myanmar. Myanmar is in Asia, and Rakhine is at the bottom, as you can see on this map. A few years ago, some people in Myanmar got very angry with the Rohingya because they're Muslims, a group of Muslims living in Rakhine. The extremists said they were worried about terrorism, but it seemed like they were actually worried about people who weren't the same as them. Rohingya villages and towns were attacked, houses were burned, people were hurt or killed. They were so scared they ran from their homes. But not everybody could run. Old people, sick people, young children had to stay behind. Hazina has to stay behind to take care of her brother and her cousin. She has to find them shelter. She has to find them food. Above all, she has to keep them safe, all without the help of a mother and father. What would you do in her situation? Now it's your turn to write the story your way. Your mom and dad wakes you in the middle of the night. Enemy soldiers have invaded your street. War has come to town. Now the life of your younger brother and your cousin depend on you. You must find a way to dodge the soldiers and hide. Right now, outside, soldiers are in the street. Where do you go? What do you do? How will you survive? Have you ever had to do something really hard? I'm pretty sure you have. Well, remember what that was like and use your experience to write your story. Here are some other questions to help you with your writing. Myanmar is hot and humid with jungly forests and fast rivers. There are paddy fields too where people grow rice. So when you get outside, what can you see? What can you smell? What plants are there? What are the people like and the houses? Every story needs characters. And here you're the main character. But who are the other people in your story? Who will you need to protect? Will they be your best friends, your brothers and sisters? So now you have everything you need to write your own version of Hazina. I look forward to reading it.